Hey guys, welcome to the channel and welcome to the reaction of the PlayStation 5 hardware reveal. So I have already seen pics and stuff of what it looks like, but I just thought I'd give the trailer a little bit of a watch because I didn't watch it last night in the PlayStation 5 event. I didn't catch much of it, but I have put my reactions up for some of the games that they announced. If you guys haven't seen them, go check them out. But yeah, let's, let's just get into it and then I can talk about it after. I think they have like this big massive build up and then the actual reveal is like the last minute or so. <laughs> it's it's a console guys. What what are you what are you trying to achieve with this? If anything you're making me scared of it. Oh wow, well, look at that. It's doing all the shapes. Wow. <laughs> and then at the end of this weird dark mystic hallway will be the PlayStation 5. I'm guessing. Honestly, I'm kind of spooked right now. Can you guys hear that breathing? That's honestly unnerving. Oh, oh, change of mood here. Very sexy. <laughs> oh, here it is. Okay, so they have gone for the white design. I don't know, are they gonna have a black one? Oh, okay. Oh, we're getting all shots like this. Did we really need music like this, guys? Are you trying to get me to want to make love to this console? Because it is working. Oh, it looks like styrofoam. Whoa. It does look really good though. It does look a lot like a Wi-Fi router. <laughs> I know a lot of other people have said that. I do like the look of the controller. I, I don't know. The reason I like the PlayStation controller so much is because it isn't as chunky as the Xbox controllers. And this one looks like it's going to be way more chunky. And I don't think I'm going to like that. I like the sleek, thin feel of like, oh, we have more of the PlayStation 4 controllers. Oh wow, they duplicated it. All right, PlayStation 5 Digital Edition and uh, PlayStation 5. PlayStation 5 Digital Edition? Oh, is that for digital games only? What? A media remote. Oh, the headphones. Oh, they're gorgeous. I am definitely not gonna buy them though. <laughs> I have so many pairs. Okay, right, interesting. Okay, so they've gone for the very uh, sexy trailer there. I like that it stands up though, the console, because having to lie my PlayStation flat can be a pain in the butt sometimes because obviously it takes up a lot of space. I mean, you should see under my desk, it is a total mess. But having the console stand up and everything would really help out with that. Tiny thing, but it helps, even though it looks like a Wi-Fi router. But the, what's with the media remote and stuff? What's the remote for? The PlayStation? Are they bringing out a TV for it? The headphones though, did you see how gorgeous they were? They were so sleek, but... I have so many damn pairs. I can't. I'm excited. Um, I, I know a lot of people have negative thoughts about it. I think it's very pretty. The fact that it's white though, I feel like it's going to get so messy so easily. And it's going to get covered in dust and fluff because my room is a total mess. And it's not it's not going to be looking sleek for very long, I tell you. I do like the controller, except I, I know I've seen it somewhere else as well. I do feel like... The controller is wearing a pair of dungarees. Like once you hear that, you can't unsee it. It just looks like it's wearing a pair of dungarees. I, I can't, I can't explain that anymore to you. It's really hard to unsee. I, I don't, I like how nice it looks, but then I don't know how much I'll actually like holding it in my hands. It's just the buttons were so flat. I feel like you have to like really press them. Like I like the feel of pressing in the buttons and they looked like they don't really press in too far. It's more like a touch play kind of thing. I mean, I know they probably will push in, but they look very flat. And it does look really chunky. I like that the PlayStation 4 controllers are like a lot more sleek and whatnot, and they just fit into my hands easier than the big clunky Xbox controllers. And it feels like they've kind of gone towards Xbox's side this time with it. But I do think it looks very gorgeous. It's not what I was expecting, but I like it. I, I ain't complaining really. So this was a bit of a pointless reaction video. I don't know why I recorded this. I just wanted to like maybe give my thoughts and stuff, even though I'm pretty much probably just saying things that people have already said. But it's good. I like it. It looks nice. Well done, Sony. Except tell us the price. How expensive is it going to be? Because I've heard it's meant to be super mega expensive, like 700 quid. But I think those were just rumors. I think it's really going to be around the, what was it? Like the 400, 500 mark. If it's like 500, I can't. <laughs> I, I cannot, but I guess we'll have to wait and find out. But I hope you guys enjoyed this weird reaction and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye guys. Hey, yo.